Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to be going over how to hopefully be able to reset and repair your Windows 10 Master Boot Record. So the Master Boot Record, abbreviated the MBR, is the first sector information on your hard disk that identifies exactly how your computer can locate your operating system. And the whole point of this is that the master boot record will tell your computer which operating system to boot into. That is pretty much what the core of what the master boot record is. And I know there are many errors that could be associated with it. So in this brief tutorial, I'm going to be going over how to reset the master boot record. So one way how to get into our troubleshooting menu is if you power down your computer without properly shutting it down which I'm assuming many of you have had to do because you actually cannot get into Windows. I believe after the third try, uh, Windows will automatically start to load automatic um, repair. So I've already done it a few times and the computer is going to enter it by default because uh, the computer has kept crashing. So this is a nice little feature now. So the computer is just loading the automatic repair tool right now. Keep in mind, we're not using any CDs or DVDs or anything bootable to get to this menu. Windows 10 is taking care of it on its own. Okay, so we get this little window that says automatic repair. Your PC did not start correctly. Press restart to restart your PC, which can sometimes fix the problem. And you can also press advanced options to try other options to repair your PC. We're going to select the advanced options button on the right side here. So underneath advanced options, we're going to select troubleshoot. It should be the middle option here. Again, now that we're underneath the troubleshooting page, we're going to left click on advanced options again. So you're going to have to click on it twice essentially. So now while we're underneath the advanced options, what we're going to do is select the command prompt tile on the top right here. And you want to left click on that. Okay, so now that we are in the command prompt, what we want to do is type in B O O T R E C. So boot rec dot E X E. Then you want to do a space here. And then type forward slash on your keyboard. And you're going to type in fix, F-I-X, M-B-R, fix, M-B-R, master boot record, which is what it really stands for. So it should read out here, boot rec.exe forward slash fix M-B-R. And once you've typed that in, you want to hit enter on your keyboard. You see the operation has completed successfully. And honestly, guys, that's about it. And it was as simple as that, guys. At this point, you can just close out of this command prompt window and select continue at the top to try and boot back into Windows 10. So this isn't guaranteed to work for everybody. It does seem as though there's a pretty high success rate. So that is why I wanted to share this brief tip with you guys. And I truthfully hope that it did work and that your problems have been resolved. So as always, thank you guys for tuning into this tutorial. Hope it worked for you, and I hope to see you in the next video. Have a great rest of your day. Bye.